Hey guys, what is going on everybody? It's Bunch Gamer. Welcome to week 5 of the Miami Dolphins third season. We are about to take on the Minnesota Vikings. And then after that we get the Detroit Lions, the Las Vegas Raiders, the Los Angeles, um, the Los Angeles Chargers, the Chicago Bears, the Green Bay Packers, the Jacksonville Jaguars, Buffalo Bills, Denver Broncos, the Jets, the Patriots, and finally the Steelers. But let's get into the Minnesota, Go Minnesota Vikings game. Where the Minnesota Vikings take on the Miami Dolphins. Alright, so we are here at US Bank Stadium here in Minnesota. Am I nervous? Oh, you know it. But we've got to get a W here today. We've got to get a victory here today against the Minnesota Vikings. And nice job getting the run. Let's see. Your Kirk Cousins is going to be coming up pretty soon, so. Here we go. There we go. Cousins looking. Looking. Throws to the right. Gets Kyle Rudolph open. He's got some space. He's got the first down at the 40 yard line. Minnesota Vikings are coming off a victory over Jacksonville. And so here we go. We got to get him in. Oh my God. What did you do? You'll make a mistake. You could have sacked him. I don't think it would have let you. No extra code. Here we go. Second and four. Cousins goes down. And there goes Robert. Sacking him. Go. Got to the defense. And the defense got to the offense. And are you fucking kidding me, you stupid mother... Come on. In front, I had a chance. No. Incomplete. All right, so here we go. Let's see what the Vikings have in store for us, guys. They got a first and ten. I guarantee you, I guarantee you guys, Kirk Cousins is going to be coming at us very hard. Oh, he was going to do it. Oh, my God. Wow, the pressure got to him, and Kirk Cousins was going to hand it off. And he could not. I believe he's going to hand off the cook, but he couldn't. And down goes Cousins, but he throws it incomplete. Third and 11. Like I said, guys, Minnesota's been, they've been doing go. pretty good, you know. You're in week five. We're three and one this season. There's a chance right there. He's got Rudolph again. First down. We got to watch Kyle Rudolph. Knowing that, you know, last season we versed the Vikings in preseason. We did pretty damn good. You guys have seen that if you have not. Oh, look how Watkins goes down and gets Cousins down for a big sack. A seven-yard loss. So here we go. Cousins hands it off. No, he's going to fake it. Throws. Gets Thielen. And Thielen is there. Jones tackles him. Three. Here we go. The opportunity for the Minnesota Vikings to convert here. There's a chance. And Cook's not going anywhere. Fourth and six. They got to go for a field goal. Well, that's just start. It's really startling and sad. And the kick is up. It is good, and so the Vikings will start off with a 3-0 lead over the Miami Dolphins. I mean, that's kind of not how I wanted to start off, but hey, you know, we could start something too. No, didn't get anywhere. All right, so we got a minute, two left. Let's go for the running game since we've been doing pretty good with the running game. Since Howard's been doing pretty good with that running game, he's been, you know, he's getting some yards in there. But this season's just been a little bit different than what I expected it to actually be. There's a throw, and that's almost intercepted as he throws incomplete. Third and four, we're going to run it here. Let's see if we can get something going here. And we will not get the first down. We'll be short one yard. We're going to go for it. This is risky. We're risking it for the biscuit. Here we go for the first down. And we got the first down and more. Still on his feet. Look at Howard. Howard's gone. No, not able to tackle him, but finally gets tackled. Right around the 30-yard line. Beautiful play by the Miami Dolphins. And Howard's been on his feet. Well, this is going to be big. And it'll be dropped for a loss of two. Dang it. That's not how this wanted. All right, that's not what I wanted. 
And still gonna get nothing. All right. Third and nine. I need something to happen. 12 seconds to go. We need something to go. There's a throw. He's got the catch. Nobody drops it. So now we've got to go for a field goal and tie the game. And the kick is up. It is good. And we have tied the game at three. So let's see if we can get something going here. Kirk Cousins has three seconds left. And we're going to see what the Miami Dolphins can do against the Minnesota offense. Minnesota offense has been pretty good, but we managed to make a stop on third down. And they had to kick a field goal. So here we go in the second quarter. It's kind of dangerous knowing that this could end everything. This rivalry has just gotten started. And he, Kirk Cousins just threw his, overthrew his receiver. And he's shotgun, look out, look at the play. That's almost intercepted. Nothing going, he could have the chance he overthrew him. Nobody was open, but he was pressured. And here we go. Cousins looks, Cousins going to throw, that's going to be almost intercepted. And they go three and out. So the Minnesota Vikings have been stopped for the first time. Well, actually for the second time. We're not going to call a fair catch here, we're just going to take it out. See how far we can get. No, got down to the 35, all right. Let's get that running game going. Knowing that we got the ball back, we need to make something happen here. An opportunity. Howard runs it. Nice job. That's a gain of five. Not really what I wanted, but it's something. Tied at three. Hoping to start off this third season with a big victory. Knowing that I said it was going to start with the Saints. I said that wasn't. All right, we're going to keep going with the run here in time. You know, quick, take the clock and run it down. Down goes Howard. Another five-yard gain. Okay, now we got to throw it. Now I feel like I need something to happen here. No! Fitzpatrick gets sacked. Are you kidding me? Third and 11. Wow. And there's a big chance he didn't want to take. That I didn't want to take. A chance. He's got the catch and first down. Beautiful play by the Miami Dolphins. They've been doing pretty good on this offense. We're trying to be number one on offense, guys. That's all we're doing. We got enough time here. I mean, I'm not really, you know, I don't care about the time. If this is the fourth quarter, I'd be very worried. It's dropped down right around the, uh, excuse me, the 35 or the, the 25, excuse me. Down to run it out. And look at this. He's got room down to the five. A beautiful play. They're close. They're in the red zone. An opportunity for Miami to strike. And no. Actually, he's going to lose a yard there. So the minute 30 to go. We need to get something to go. And he's got an opening. He's in. Touchdown, Miami. And the Dolphins are in the lead again. And there you go. The Dolphins are right back where they started. And the kick is up. It is good. Oh, my. You gotta say, when Miami plays, we play very good. We play very good. But knowing that we have our backup quarterback, I'm really not sure how this is going to go. Down he goes. Gets brought down right around the 24-yard line. And they'll start off right at the 24. The opportunity. Cousins looks. Cousins looking. Throwing. That's almost caught, but he drops it. Went for a diving play, and that would have been very dangerous. Second and 10. Cousins once again in shotgun. He's got Cook in the backfield. Cook looking. No. He could not find. Found Kyle Rudolph, but I don't think Rudolph could get me there. So here we go. And there's a nice throw as he gets nothing. Thielen, Adam Thielen was there, but again, they go three and out. Flex round! Flex round! And here we 
we go. They're going to punt. 54 seconds to go. This will take the clock down. And they will punt with 45 seconds to go. They're going to let it bounce. Not even going to take it. That'll bring us down to the 15. So we need to work on what we're doing here. We need to make sure that we get something going. And they're going to make some stop. Get two yard gain right there. All right, we need to do something now. So we, we need to be conservative. Here we go. Throws it big. Gets that first down. No, oh, he drops it. Are you kidding me? 27 seconds. Throws it. Gets the catch. First down. We need to call a timeout immediately. No, we cannot. Dang it. Now we need to call a timeout. 21 seconds to go. We need something to happen right now. He's a play. He's got another catch and another one. And once again, we're not taking a timeout. We're take, well, well, I said we're not taking any timeouts. We're taking timeouts. Let's Throw go. this one deep. There's a throw. He does not have it. It's incomplete. 11 seconds. Come on, let's go. One timeout remaining. Here we go. Throw it. He's got the catch. He's got the first down. He's out of bounds, though. Let's go. The end zone. He's got the catch. Is it in time? Timeout, let's get the field goal unit out. Let's get the field goal unit out. Let's make it a 10-point game before halftime. Kick is up. It is good, and we make it a 10-point game heading into halftime. Beautiful play by the Miami Dolphins. A very different game for the Minnesota Vikings, knowing that they came off a win over Jacksonville. And we're coming off a win against the Buffalo Bills, so... There's something new. All right, let's get this running game going, knowing that we're leading by three. Fitzpatrick hands it off to Howard. Howard's going to take it, and he'll probably get a couple yards out of that. He gets about, oh, a good six-yard gain. Nice job. I like that. Here's Fitzpatrick now. Looking throws, gets the catch. He's got Grin. Gusicki. I don't know if that's Chris. I don't know. Fitzpatrick. And take the run. He is going to get decked, but he thought he was. Oh my gosh. I thought he was going to get uh, knocked in the backfield for that. On, but I go. guess he gained three yards. That's actually a positive right there. Beautiful play. Oh my gosh. Gets hit hard. All right. We need three more yards. Come on. Let's go. Here we go. Nine. So all we need is three more yards, and we will get the three yard gain. And there it is. Now we can work with the passing game we've got going. There's a throw. There's the incomplete pass. Oh, man. Season's going to be easy for us, but I have this on the hardest difficulty. There's a chance. It's intercepted by Smith. And this can turn the whole game around. No one's getting him. Finally brought down. Wow. Here we go. What? 202 Nine. left. What? Here we go. Takes the snap. Cousins looking. Cousins throws. That's incomplete. Hit it off one of the receivers. Actually, one of the um uh, one of the uh defenders. Here we go. Cousins looks. Cousins gets a man open. He's got Rudolph. Kyle Rudolph gets a first down. The Minnesota Vikings managed to make a comeback here. I'm going to be very disappointed, but I doubt it. The Miami Dolphins have been doing pretty good this season. That's a catch, but he drops it incomplete. Cousins was pressured. Nothing you could do about it. It's now second and ten. Ball right around the 49-yard line. Their own 49. And down goes Cousins. He got right through the receiver, right through the defender, on, and go. got to Cousins. Ohio. Ohio. 
Here we go. Oh, that's incomplete. Bat it down. There's something you don't know. All right. So they are going to punt with a minute 33 left to go. Fourth and 12. And he punts, and that's going to go out of bounds. And now Miami will take over. The Miami Dolphins coming up a win over the Buffalo Come Bills. On, let's go! We had a good game against Buffalo, but they just did no chance. And there's a big tackle. It's a two-yard gain. Here we go! Very careful about what I'm doing with the passing game. There's a throw. That's caught. Let's go! Now here we go. We got to get that running game going. Get that running game going, boys. Nice. Going to mark me right around the 49? Yes, we are. Right around the 39. That's going to be a big incomplete catch. Couldn't get anywhere. Here we go. Minute three left. There's a throw. He needs it. He's got the... No, it's intercepted. Let's go. Minute 38. Minute 38. Minute 13 to go. And they hand it off to Cook. And Cook's got something. Excuse me, Ham. And he's got a first down. Wow. Here we go! What? 90! Vikings could what? make this a very, very hard game to play against. That's exactly what's going on. They've got Cook. Another. Let's go! Thought that was going to be a first down, but it's not. And down goes Cousins! Roberts was there for the sack. 34 go. seconds to go. What? 36. They need six yards to convert. And once again, the Vikings, they know what's in trouble. They know their season is in trouble. Here's a big play. That is intercepted. And they'll be taken down. Beautiful play by the Miami Dolphins. Here we go. Can't allow the sack. Gets the incomplete catch anyways. Okay, we got to run it then. I don't feel like taking a chance throwing it because if I get sacked or hit for a loss, that could be trouble. And we'll just take this down for the final, for the end of the... Big play, big play, big play. Can throw it to the side, not getting anywhere. Four than five, we need five yards to go. If we don't get these five yards, I'm, I'm, we're in trouble. Two seconds, here we go. Snap the ball, here we go. Throws it, here we go. Not gonna catch a bit of a play, got it. And we'll go to the fourth quarter now. Now it's time for us to run it. Here we go! What? Minnesota Vikings don't stand a chance in a running game. The running game is actually third place this season. So we've been doing pretty good in the running game. We need to continue that. If we keep continuing that all season long, I think something could stir up. I think we could make it back to the playoffs if we wanted to, but... We need to make sure we, you Let's know, go. take the clock and tick it all the way down to its, to its, oh man, he got way good yards. Beautiful play right there, first and ten. Let's go. What? Minnesota Vikings defense is starting to crumble. You can definitely see that it's starting to crumble as he gets right around the 25-yard line. Here we go. Oh, excuse me, what? the 40-yard line. What? As he hands it off again, and he's going to get stuffed in the backfield. For one gain, actually. I'm just going to keep the on, time ticking go. here. What? 90. What? 90. Basically all we're going to do. And he's got big room. He's got that first down. Two minutes left here in the fourth quarter. Minnesota has not taken a timeout. Well, they have. But that was way back in the second, uh, excuse me, third quarter, actually. There's a play. Howard gets a good yard. And Minnesota will take their second timeout. So now the pressure is on Minnesota. We got a 10-point game. It's this this is the lowest scoring game I've seen this season. Down he goes. He'll be brought down right about the 20-yard line. Now I think it's time for us to get our passing game going. See if we get the end zone and cry their tears out. With a catch, no. Incomplete. Minute 50. So they have no timeouts left. And we're throwing it. What is my problem? 
He's got wide open. He's got a first down. That should be a touchdown, though. On, and we go. can make this a big game. Yes, he's in. Touchdown, Miami. And this is just about to wrap up the season. Or wrap up the game. Kick is up. This is good. And let's see what they can do with a minute 38 left. If Minnesota can't get anything done with a minute 38, they're, already, they're going to be in trouble. You know, this season, it hasn't been going well for the Miami... You know, it's been going well for the Miami Dolphins, but it has not been going well for the Minnesota Vikings. They're, you know, Minnesota Vikings are 2-2 two and two coming into Week 5. Here we go. Cousins looking. Cousins is going to get sacked by Roberts again. And Roberts once again. Yeah. Roberts Ohio, once again Ohio. gets to him. What? In the backfield. And so here we go. Oh my gosh. Kurt Cousins can't get anywhere. Third and 21. There this is go. now what? devastating for the Miami, no. for the Miami Dolphins. Not. We're just devastating the Minnesota Vikings here. Cousins, Cousins, look. Not going anywhere. Cook again. They lose three yards. Fourth and... It's now going to be fourth and 24 to go. A minute three to go. If Cousins can't convert, this is going to be dangerous if they cannot convert because they will give the Miami Dolphins and put them in the red zone. A chance. And that's going to be putting the Miami Dolphins in the red zone. And I think we're going to take it with a chance. 54 seconds to go. We're going to take that opportunity they gave us. We're just going to keep ticking the clock down. But we're going to make this a 27. And oh, wow. Walks right in. Howard, touchdown Miami. And this is just about it. That's it. That's game. That is the game, ladies and gentlemen. And there you go, the kick is up, it is good, and Miami's got a 27-3 lead. Wow. Wow. What a devastating blow to my to excuse me to Minnesota. Miami should have learned. But we've been you know, we've we we struggled against the New York the New York Jets. But the Minnesota Vikings in this game have just not gotten anything going. Cousins and shotgun, 37 seconds to go. Throw, caught, and it's almost intercepted. Come on. Roan would have had that one gone. That could have sealed the game for good. Here we go. Cousins looking again. Throws, gets through. Pop open. 30 seconds to go. Miami Dolphins looking for their biggest win, their fourth win this season. Looking, looking, got him, he's got the catch, he's got um, Jefferson. 18 seconds to go, remember, no timeouts for the Minnesota Vikings. 27 to 3. And that's going to be incomplete, 9 seconds to go. you got to watch what you're doing. Miami Dolphins have been doing very good on defense, but the Minnesota Vikings have been struggling right now on offense. The only thing they've managed to get is a field goal. There's a chance. There's a big throw. This has got to be it. This seals the deal. Interception. And that will seal the deal. That will seal the deal here in Minnesota. As Miami Dolphins take the win. 27-3 final. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And I will see you guys on the live stream this Saturday. I'll see you guys later.